Alright, this is Mofo See That, and today we're going to be looking at the uh, Bluefin Bandai booth, which includes this Gunpla Navigation Catalog for 2014, and the Tamashi Tom Nations Catalog for 2014, Winter and Spring, about the various brands they have. Let's start with this. So Tamashi Nations is a fusion of our top brands. Tamashi means soul. It's built from creative DNA and powered by passion. So let's see what passion they have. So over here is the various brands they have so far. The SH Figure Arts, the Figure Arts Zero, which is the statue version. The SH Monster Arts, the Arts for Digimon, Ultra Act, uh, Soka Sokaku Henshin, Soul Chokokin, the DX Soul Chokokin, Metal Build SIC, Prokapika, Robot Damashi, and so here for 2014, they have the Super Mario SH Figure Arts. So here's the three sets you can have. The Mario, the Goomba, another Goomba Turtle Shell. And so the SH Monster Arts, you have Alien, Predator, another Alien. And then some more stuff for the Godzilla series, which is Gigan from Final Wars, uh, Batra, Biolante. Mothra, the Millennium version of Godzilla, a uh, Mecha Godzilla Type 3, this is the original 1964 version of Godzilla, and this is 1995 version of Godzilla from when he was burning up. And so here we have a collaboration for the 40th anniversary of Hello Kitty. So you have the Chokokin Hello Kitty, sends a robot, and submarine, and whatnot. And for here we have the uh, Power Rangers, the original Mighty Morphin team. With here the Armored Red Ranger and Green Ranger down here at the bottom. Uh, imported with uh, new American boxes. Here's the Figure Out Zero with statues of Vegeta, Goku, and Trunks. And over here for the SH Figure Arts we have Android 18 and Goku. And below we have uh, Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, Gohan, Super Saiyan, the special color version, Piccolo, Krillin, Trunks, Vegeta, Super Saiyan Vegeta, uh, Perfect Cell, and Frieza. Over here we have Propitka, which is basically a prop replica. This one we have the Sailor Moon one, SCS Figure Zero of Sailor Moon. And the regular SH figures released of the four Sailor Scouts released so far. And down here are the others. So the uh, from D Arts we have like Mega Man and others digital arts. Here we have Gal Gaigar, Yamato the spaceship, then uh, Wing Gundam. This one from Sea Destiny, Saint Seiya. These two are both Saint Seiya. These are the uh, Saint Cloth version. The AGP, which is the basically Gundams as armored girls, the SIC, which is the uh, Shin Ichigo one, which it looks really cool. And so that's that. And so here we're taking a look at the 2014 line for Gunpla. And so the first one you have this, which is always nice. The perfect grade, master grade, real grade, high grade, and then the BB non-scale. And here you have your index. It's a full 40 pages of stuff that's interesting. So here they always do the introductory, the what is Gunpla, and the five points that make it the best model kits. And then how to make Gunpla in from A to F. And here we have the timeline. Next step of evolution from the original 144th scale to high grade, master grade, perfect grade to the high grade and universal century, the mega size model which came out recently, and then the real grade. So it's nice. And so here, this is the Gundam Build Fighters which just had announced the new season. This is the original series and it's free on to watch full 
in YouTube and at Gundam.info. So here's the sets that they come with. So you have all the main characters, fighters, and the opponents they fought. And down here you have the boosters that you can add on to the kits to make them even better. Sengoku, Gundam Astray is one of them. And here you have the Unicorn Gundam series. Starts from Unicorn Gundam. This is really cool. And then there's a BB series down here. And here we're going into Gundam Seed, which has also been brought a uh, full series and thing. So there's the Master Grades, the Wheel Grades, the High Grades, Perfect Grades, and then the BB Gundams down there. And here is uh, Double Zero, which is also streaming on Gundam.info. You have the Master Grades, High Grades, and the BB Gundams here. And here is the Real Grade. The perfect combination of features from high grade, master grade, and perfect grade. So it's the realest gun plot ever for their product info. And so here's the high grade, which they will release all Gundam suits in high grade series, even the older ones that have come out before in a better uh, quality and articulation. I mean, here is all the high grade a lot of pages. It's like a lot of models you can see here. Down here is the the really awesome one. The Reborn 100, project number one, the MSN 042 Nightingale, which will release in August 2014. And basically Reborn 100 is the more refined parts and highly detailed appearance of the 1100 grade scale. So here Master Grade we have the High New Gundam version K, it looks pretty cool. And here's the Master Grade Gundams, and here we have the Perfect Grade, which has less and really, there's less models, but the detail is really, really nice. And then you have the non-scale BB Gundams, is perfect for getting kids into the series, and really fun to play with. And here's the Mega size model, which is the 148th scale. This page tells you how to do it to make it even easier for Gundam series. So, the first three were the original Gundam, the Char's version of Zaku, Zaku 2, and the two new ones is the Gundam Age 1 and the Gundam Age 2, both normal versions. Then, here we have more of the BB Gundams. And here we have a timeline of the film, TV series, and the OVAs that have come out from uh, 1979 to 2012. This, so, yeah. so it goes all the way from the original Mold Suit Gundam all the way down here to Gundam Build Fighters, which ended in March 2014. Then here we have the Bandai Hobbies Center, which they give you the process and how Gundams are created. And here, the back page is the Gundam Bridges Cup here, and then more info about Gundam.info. So, the 35th anniversary of Gundam. So you have screenings of the OVA of Unicorn, the Origin, and then Rise G Gundam, which is a new series coming out after the... Uh, new season of the Gundam Build Fighters Try. Then you have the Exia Gundam here. Looks really cool. So, this is the Bandai Bluefin booth magazines that you'll get if you went there for Anime Expo. This is Mofu Lucidax. Stay tuned for the rest of the reviews for the Anime Expo 2014 playlist. And see you next time.